In this video, I'll show you how to fix this rule is conflicting with an existing DNS record. Resolve by deleting the conflicting record in the DNS settings page. A common issue that pops up when setting up domain forwarding in Squarespace. This can be confusing, but don't worry, I'll walk you through exactly how to fix it. When you try to forward a subdomain, like www.pmntechfix.nl, Squarespace checks if there are existing DNS records already set for that subdomain. If there's an A record, C name, or any custom record tied to that subdomain, Squarespace won't let you add a forwarding rule until you remove the conflict. And that's what triggers the error message. Now here's how to fix it. Step 1. Go to your DNS settings. On the left panel, click Settings, then select Domains and choose your domain, for example, pmntechfix.nl. Next, scroll down and click on DNS Settings. Here, you'll see a full list of DNS records associated with your domain. Look for any existing CNAME or A records under the subdomain you were trying to forward. In most cases, it's the www record. Step 2. Delete the conflicting record. To do that, simply click the trash icon next to that DNS entry. This tells Squarespace to remove its current mapping so it no longer points the subdomain to an old destination. Once the record is deleted, go back to your forwarding settings and try adding the rule again. This time, it should work without any errors. Quick note, if you're forwarding your root domain with at as the subdomain, you might need to remove multiple conflicting A records, usually the default Squarespace ones. Don't worry, once forwarding is active, you won't need those A records anymore. And that's it, you successfully fixed the domain forwarding conflict in Squarespace. If this helped, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, 